episode of the Bay of Fundy Travel Show. We are here in the beautiful coastal hamlet of Halls Harbour, Nova Scotia. We're going to go exploring today, take a walk along the boardwalk, pop into the lobster pound to have a tour and have a lobster for lunch. We have left-handed and right-handed lobsters. Really? So, yes. That's so, cool. <laughs> underneath, the female has soft, feathery swimmerettes here at the end. Very soft and feathery. Whereas the male, theirs is hard and grooved. I've never touched a lobster. Is that right? And you're like, no! I'll let you touch. Okay, I'm a rock on cans. <laughs> there are no lobsters in cans. <laughs> This, wow. this fella here, wow. this fella here, he's 11 pounds, so he's about 70 to 75 years old. His tail for, rub his tail for a minute, and he'll fall asleep. So the deal here at Halls Harbor is uh, that you come into the gift shop and you order your lobster and you get to choose any size you want, so that's kind of handy. That, there's a five pound one that's like this big, but you want to be hungry for that one, I think. Okay, which one would you like? Um, how about that guy right there? Does that look alright? That looks great. Pound and three quarter. Pound and three quarter? Perfect. Right. Starving. <laughs> So once you get your lobster number, the next thing to do is to find a table and wait for your lobster to come. Oh, what do you have? Hi, how Hi, are you? I'm today? fine, thank you. Is that my lobster? That sure oh, is. Oh, it's beautiful. And your potato salad, thank meal you. Package. This is a very typical way to be served lobster here on the Bay of Fundy. It's usually steamed or boiled and brought to the table whole like this uh, with a nice fresh dollop of potato salad and a roll and melted butter for dipping. And of course, you can also wear a lobster bib if you like very chic Bay of Fundy fashion. Here I am uh, standing on the ocean floor, basically under all that water that we saw when we first arrived here in Halls Harbor. Uh, this is the boat that we saw earlier unloading a lobster and it's also sitting dry on the ocean floor. It's really quite incredible to think that only four or five hours ago this water was right up to the top of this wharf, which is about 25 feet above my head. That's the amazing Bay of Fundy for you. Fundy also inspires a lot of creativity and there are some fantastic little galleries here in the hamlet of Halls Harbor. Well, no trip to Halls Harbor is complete without stopping at Parker's store. Um, Vilda, your store's been here for what, 110 years? years. 105 years. Mm -hmm. And it is absolutely the best place to pick up some Bay of Fondi dulse. This is uh, an edible seaweed that uh, many of us eat who live around the Bay of Fondi. It's very, very good for you. I'm actually 100 years old, did you know that? <laughs> I've been eating dulse all these years. So. <laughs> Mm, that's really good dolls. So I'll take that big bag, Velda. Thank you. There are several really nicely done interpretive panels here on the Halls Harbor Boardwalk where you can learn a bit about the tides, the history of fishing, the lighthouse, and pirates. 
Thanks for joining me for today's episode from Halls Harbor, Nova Scotia. We'll catch you next time on the Bay of Fundy Travel Show. I guess those are... <laughs>